My name is Beth Hiley here for Board Game Geek TV at Gen Con 2014. I'm sitting down with Elad Goldstein once again of Golden Egg Games. Thank welcome, you. welcome back. Game, no, game <laughs> yeah. number two. Game number two. Which yeah. I have to say, probably one of the most fun game names I'm going to get to say today. Super Fantasy Ugly Snouts Assault. Yes, <laughs> indeed. Uh, yeah, uh, it's a very cartoonish like game, but it's, um, it's a nice game that we bought from Italy. And uh, we will publish the second edition in English. Uh, this is uh, roughly the first edition. We have some changes in the component, but the major game we, 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 we doesn't change the rules, make them a bit uh, better, but uh, <laughs> just, uh, ju just a touch. But the game is the same as the, sa the first edition. The first edition was run out uh, very quickly, so we picked up uh, the second edition. And it should be in, by November, I think, in stores. Okay. And uh, we have all the distribution channel uh, ready for it. So oh, fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's, uh, it's going fast, really, uh, in printing. And we should expect it by November. So, right. um, um, what, what are ugly snouts? <laughs> yeah, so uh, <laughs> ugly, uh, Super Fantasy, it's a dungeon crawler. But it's meant to be uh, more um, lighter. Uh, Dungeon Crawler it has a very unique, unique uh, system inside installed. It can be played for one to six player, although it's really recommended to have uh, more players than uh, least. And also, it, uh, it ate and up, so you can play with kids, which is, uh, um, I think, the first Dungeon Crawler family type game. And uh, you can see all, all already from the artwork of the uh, yeah. <laughs> of, the, of, the, of the characters you have in the game, and you have like a fully, you know, stories about oh, them that you yeah. can read oh. for your kids. Lucky with, Lock, the gunslinger. Yeah, you have <laughs> like a, a fully themed, uh, um, really funky <laughs> fantasy because you have guns, right? <laughs> Everybody has guns. But uh, I love the artwork, and it's very lovely, so kids can relate to it without, um, you know, uh, it's, it's, it's not PG-13, right? right, right? right? Yeah. <laughs> or, or, or worse. Mm -hmm. um, so um, the game is a dungeon crawler, and the main mechanics here uh, you will set up with your uh, you have your own shit, uh, you have your own uh, heroes, and they will try to you have uh, many scenarios. You have like uh, I cannot show you, but you have tons of scenarios. Yeah, I was looking packed in, watching you flip through the rule book, all different sorts yeah. of setups and, of and dungeons. I, I think like 90 minutes is it's, it's starting point in this game. You can go up to. You have a scenario for three hours for sure, so you have like the whole day adventure to do with your kids if they have uh, the stamina to sustain such a long. But uh, the designer is actually posting uh, more campaigns and more uh, scenarios uh, on uh, on the on the website, so you have you can download the the, the schematics and, and know. But uh, let's say let's look about uh, on this scenario. Mm -hmm. You have a time limit there. Each scenario has its own time limit. Uh, let's say it's, so this uh, yeah, this right count, here by my yeah, elbow. This counts rounds of play. And you need to complete the task. Um, in this task, you need uh, those guys, uh, those heroes need to get to this Stand big room. Stand on these four Yeah, spots. yeah, and, uh, and, and there is a big snack there, <laughs> uh, 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 a big boss there. <laughs> no, a big snout is a lot better. <laughs> yeah, 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 a huge one, actually. It's like, uh, I cannot show you, but it's, it's a big one. So they need to pass on those uh, tackles. You have, um, in this game, which is really unique, you have your own character, which is not unique, but you have this characteristic that will define your abilities. So you have strength, which is used for melee, cunning, you, you can uh, sneak attack, and aim is uh, for shooting, magic is to cast uh, spells, mm -hmm. speed is the way that you can go around, and defensive is, uh, of course, when you're sustaining damage. So in this game, you will have dice. You will start your, your turn, and you will need to allocate how much dice you want to do for each task. So for moving, maybe I want to move a lot. So you, I roll, uh, I don't need them to move, so I roll two. So when you roll two, then I move three. So if you, in this turn, you need to go for a distance, then I, I can allo allocate more cubes, mm -hmm. uh, more dice, uh, so, uh, sorry, and more dice to roll so I can do it. But if I have spare dice, because I, 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 I jumped in really quickly, I can spend time into bashing on, uh, starting unlocking uh, wooden pieces, which is... Uh, a chest, which, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah the wooden chest, but those are almost handmade or some barrels, or bashing doors, or, uh, or, or, or unlocking. You can, you can go on the fully aggressive mode <laughs> by bashing, and, bang, you bang, can, bang, bang, bang. and it depends on the character. But each time you roll this tile, you will relate 
to the number that those characteristics you have in your hero. So if I have speed of three, which you cannot roll, so each time I roll, I, I, I will really move faster than the other guys. So you need to plan your turn, and that's it. You have six cubes. You can do anything. You can bash doors, you can uh, hit snouts, you can try to flank them and hit them from the behind because you have special rules about surprising and stuff like that, being cunning. And also it introduced a really cool um, ability mode that you can al al always uh, can upgrade them. But this is sneak attack. This is charge up like in, uh, in video games, mm -hmm. when yes. you charge up your special ability, it goes up a notch every, every a couple of turns, depending on, on the conditioning. Once it charge up, you can unleash it, which is very cool, because <laughs> you're charging up your special abilities, and then you can have like a spe super, super turn <laughs> and a bash off thing. Of course, as every game, you can, um, you can when you're bashing a, a chest or, or barrel, you find like uh, more, uh, more, uh, more weapons, and uh, of course you can have experience and level up your special abilities. You can level up uh, your health, and um, it, it's it, it's it's a short. Uh, it, it's not like a, a campaign mode that you can build up your character indefinitely. But for a 19, two hours play, you can really build up your character and drive through crazy to that um, uh, dungeon, which is all it does. It's super yeah. fun. Yeah. When I could see how there'd be a lot of replayability by playing a different character the next time, by doing a different dungeon yes. setup the next time. So. Yeah, and, and also we already signed up. I, I think uh, Red Glove, which is our Italian par partner, will publish uh, in this uh, Essen in Spiel. They will have a, a second scenario box, which is a standalone for skeletons. I don't recall the name because it's, uh, <laughs> it has <laughs> like a funky name also. But uh, they will have a, a complete standalone uh, campaign for uh, skeletons with new characters that you can combine. Oh, fantastic. So you can like do like a five-hour super fantasy <laughs> dungeon crawling fun, which is uh, <laughs> intense. Well, Elad, I this looks this does look like a super lot of fun. I yeah. I, I kind of want to play this just to see what the big snow big snouts look like. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, so when um, you had mentioned, and I, if you wouldn't mind just telling me again, when do you think this is? Uh, it will be, I think, by November, and um, it, it's it just finished uh, printing. We should have got here a better copy, but. Uh, yeah, no. A common story for, for many people. Yeah, 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 yeah. We try to. We really try to. But it's a very, very fun game. You have, uh, it's, it's, it, you, with 10 year old, 9 year old kids, you have fun. Well, I can't wait to check it out personally, and uh, thanks for bringing it by. Thank you. <laughs>